New home sales rise to the occasion and the Fed reverts back to its old ways. No rate hike this month. Ahead on Thursday's News Wrap. Buyers are beginning to show their increasing demand for housing by purchasing more homes since the end of the financial crisis, but inventory still remains an issue. The U.S. Census Bureau and HUD reported Wednesday that the sales of new single-family houses rose to 10.8% from November 2015 to December 2015 to an estimated seasonally adjusted annual rate of 544,000. In November, the revised rate of new home sales was 491,000. Year over year, new single family home sales are up 9.9% above the December 2014 estimate of 495,000. The data estimates that a total of 501,000 new homes were sold in 2015, up 14.5% above the 2014 figure of 437,000. As the first meeting of the year came to a close, the Federal Open Market Committee agreed to leave the federal funds rate at its current level due to economic worries. The FOMC minutes released Wednesday afternoon showed that Fed officials are concerned about inflation still running below the target level of 2%. This hindrance is partially the fault of falling energy prices and prices of non-energy imports. The Fed did not back off their previous forecast for more rate hikes in 2016, but with the economy in a questionable state, the committee is just not certain when the rates will go up again. You can check out all these stories and all the latest happenings in the industry right here on our site. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you again on Friday at TheMReport.com, your source for the latest news and strategies in the evolving mortgage market.